Hi, this is Ann Wood, and I'm going to show you how to make a perfect bird leg. What you're going to need is some 18 or 19 gauge wire. My favorite by far is from the Hillman Wire Company because, and I'm using 18 gauge, um, it has one side that's a little bit flat and that really helps your bird legs stay together. You're also going to need a pair of needle nose pliers, wire cutters, floral tape, in any color you choose. I use brown because I usually make brownish bird legs. A hammer, and you're going to need something hard to tap the wire with the hammer. I'm using a little anvil, but um, any, any hard surface will do. Even an old cutting board would make a good surface, or something hard and metal and flat. So what I've done is cut a piece of wire. Um, oh, by the way, I got this wire at Lowe's. You can also find it online. Um, and I've cut a piece that's about five and a half inches long. And then I'm going to take my needle nose pliers and I'm going to grasp the wire one inch from one end. And I'm going to bend it over, making a loop that crosses over the, the other side of the wire. I'm going to move these things so you can see a little better. Let's just take that wire right out of there. And then I'm going to grasp it just above where it crosses, and with my fingers, as tightly as I can, I'm going to wind it three times around. And the wire is pretty stiff. If you find it too difficult, you can use a lower gauge wire, but I like, I like a stiff wire. Um, here's, here's our leg so far. Now I'm going to take my anvil or other hard surface and I'm just going to tap where the wrap is. And that is so when we do this part, the whole thing doesn't fall apart. The next thing I'm going to do is take my wire cutters and clip off the end of the loop, creating bird toes talons, toes, I don't know. Okay, that flew away. And then with my pliers, I'm going to open these up a little bit. I'm going to bend the back piece down a little, straighten this out. And really, if you wanted to, you could call it a day right here, but I'm going to show you a next step to finish it. I'm taking some brown floral tape pulling off about an eight or nine inch length and starting with the front toe I'm just gonna wrap it around as tightly as I can and this this is a crepe sort of stretchy tape that adheres to itself and then I'm going around the back toe and then I'm coming straight up the length this also gives your legs some thickness, which I think looks nice. And I'm coming back down, starting on the other front toe, same deal, and one more time up the leg to give it a little bit more thickness. And you can repeat this as many times as you want to make your leg as thick as you want. I generally finish them with very fine glitter. I adhere it with Elmer's glue. You can also paint it with acrylic paint, or you can just leave it alone. And there it is, a perfect bird leg. Have fun.